Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Hippie Tesla, and welcome to Resident Evil 3 Nemesis, Episode 3. Resident Evil. We're finishing this tonight. I mean, it would be really silly if not. We just have three locations left. We're so close. This is it. How's everyone doing? Hello, Senpai, Lupka, Zombie. Hi, everyone. Zombie, I need you, man. You can't leave me now. You got me this far. You know this better than I do, obviously. Be my teacher, Zombie. Yeah, poor Sasha just turned around and came back to that in the chat. <laughs> Here we go. Lupka, are you ready? I actually ended this. Didn't want to finish this part yesterday because you left. This broke my heart when I was a kid. First time I got to this part. Senpai, we love you. We love you very much. I know I do. So much I'm like, I'm gonna scream. I love this man. I, I wish I had a shirt to rip it off. Sisters know what you're talking about. I'm glad, I'm glad, Lupka, you're gonna see this. Chronos gear. Okay, we got the Chronos gear. We had the Chronos key as well, Lupka. You missed that part. We also missed the part where we found a mercenary who died protecting uh, someone's daughter. And she's like dead on him. We're gonna see it now with Carlos though. So let's get let's get into this. We got freeze rounds. We got if I like I need more than two health items, I'll just restart. Ding dong. It's a very bad strategy. Look, pull all the zombies from the city this way. But okay, hmm, maybe that's why they didn't include it in the remake. They were like, this is stupid. <laughs> Makes no sense. Let's just can this love location. Okay, that's it. That's all she needs. Charge! Yeah, remember the painful look on her face and the painful sound? Here we go. Of course we love Zombie Chow. Zombie Chow is like part of family already. He's, he's even close by. He's gonna come to family gatherings soon. <laughs> Here we go. Oh my god, that apple. Here we go. Thanks, love. You're saved. Down here. It's finally over. Huh? That scream, like, it still hurts me. What a beast. Okay, it's one-on-one -on -one now. He's about to mutate. Oh, wait, there's a whole thing. That's right. Stars. Here we go. I'm doomed. Bois to you too, sir. Oh shit, he's got that. I got better run. Oh shit, that didn't work as, as well as I planned. Am I gonna die? I'll just wing it. Oh, whip, I'm gonna die. Ugh. I hope that not to use a single healing item. Yeah. <laughs> I'm already hurt. Fucking bazooka. No. Oh shit. I'm dead. Okay, it blew up. Is that it? Fuck you, God. I'm dead. Oh, I hate when he gets me in the screen transition. Get up, get up, get up. There you go. Woo! Ooh, ooh, ooh. 
No heals now, Lyubka. No heals. This is it. Well, stupidest place to walk all over into, but sure. Let me go. I'm hurt. Let me go just walk into this fire. <laughs> you think? Jill! Jill! Hang in there! What have I done? I'm sorry, Jill. Please! Oh, okay. Okay. I couldn't know that. Jill! 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 She's done an overhead shot. Night. I woke up to the sound of falling rain. I can't believe I'm still alive. Jill can take two bazookas in the face. I still love to talk about it, so... October 1st. So she slept two days? Carlos? It looks like our roles have been reversed from when we originally met, huh? Don't worry, Jill. This chapel is safe. I've been infected by the virus. In Resident Evil, yes, love. In hey, DVD, no. <laughs> take it easy. I'm okay. Don't feel any pain. But that's what bothers me. If I can't feel anything, then what does that mean? Don't give up, Jill. I'll take care of you. It means you hopped up on Whatever drugs. Do, don't let that virus beat you. It's like she's having a battle with it. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm just gonna suck in my infection. Okay, I'm good. <laughs> if I turn into a zombie, don't hesitate. I want your word that you'll kill me. This made me sad when I was a kid when she said that. I was like, no, I'm not gonna let you die. Probably explains why. Why she's my favorite Tari character. I felt bad for her. Shit, it really starts with nothing. I really gotta, oh my god, on hard mode, this is just... No. <laughs> three, so I can say three times with him. Will I find more of these? I just gotta dodge as much. You know what, I'm gonna save now. And do my best. Charge! Hi, Gammy. Good to see you, man. Um. Uh, fuck it, yeah. I hope to s not use a single herb, but I'm not good enough for that yet. A little panicky there when Nemesis appears. I'm like, oh no, please don't kill me, Mr. Nemi. Here, you can eat that guy. <laughs> Bready Brett. Oh god. <laughs> Cause I like him, sis. That's why it's genetics. No, it's not. None of you none, none of our, our uh <laughs> none of our family are so emotional with games. I like these stories. This is what I like. Some people like TV. Some people like reading. I like games. I guess that's it. Charge! <laughs> Hello, Grizzly Jabarkus. Just try to dodge them all. Fuck these guys. Whoo! Welcome to the stream. Ah, uh, yeah, this is the spot where I kept dying. And let's try it again. It was very tight. Dobro sam, dobro sam, kako si ti? Oh, fuck it. Just get to the door. Yeah, there you go. Save all that ammo. Woohoo! Stars? 
Is there anything else for him to pick up? Because you... An expression of disbelief describes his last moment. Yeah, he's got different comments on everything. He does have that first day's prey I didn't pick up with Jill. I wonder. That collapsed on itself. Can you find something special with Carlos on hard mode? Like, like ammo before the hospital or anything like that? Huh, Zamboni? <laughs> Welcome to Hip Tesla Serbian lessons. The stairs are broken and cannot be used. So how would the Serb react to that, Chris Barkas? You see something like this? You go... <laughs> no, not really. No pickups. Okay, then fuck it. Charge! Thanks, Gamut. Baby spiders? No, no, thank you. I had my lunch. I'm just gonna try to run through this corridor, hopefully not get poisoned, but that's why I saved there. I'm not sure what awaits me. Well, more of those guys. No, fuck. Damn, I was just in front of the door. Will I, will I get some blue herbs or should I just go back to the save? Well, that sucks hard. Maybe there's some blue herbs here. Just push, push faster, Carlos. Stupid poison. I want to save all these. All this ammo. No blue herbs? Oh shit, then I have to reload. Because I'm gonna, I'm gonna die from this poison. Maybe in here? No, he doesn't have the key. Nothing here. Fuck. Yeah, I'm just gonna reload. Ah, <sighs> I managed to get all the way to the door and I got poisoned. Resident Evil. That shock that that goes boom. Continue. What is it? Well, you're free to come over here and show me how it's done, zombie. <laughs> you can host the show, talk a little. <laughs> we had to remove zombie's mic because he talked too much. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I'll try to just stun that one guy. Or you, you know what? I can take one bite. I guess I li really like this door. <laughs> Charge! Okay. Can't remember what what you find on hard mode with him from health items. Considering I don't want to use sprays. Whoa. Let's try again. If I get poisoned, I'll just see how far I can get. Fuck it. Ah, oh, Jesus fucking Christ with that poison spit. Stupid spiders. Go. Ugh. Oh. Two or beam, yeah. Well, that's it. Then I gotta reload. If there's no red, blue, you mean red, green, probably. I gotta kill him. Okay, let's try to get to it. Fuck it. Let's see. At least I learned something. Because the hunters are gonna be an issue. Well, there has to be. You get poisoned. I, I doubt they will just leave you to suffer that.
But I gotta wait for them to pack up here. Whoa. This time, try not to blow myself up. Don't you just love it when they spread like that? If I can kill two of them, that would be lovely. Wait, I'm gonna blow myself up, am I? Mm. Oh, that would be lovely. Yeah, okay, in the doctor's office. I'm gonna try. Can I go straight to the door? I'm gonna try to going straight to the door. Oh, but maybe there are blue herbs here, actually. Fuck it, I'll try it. They're really, they're really weak to this. Weaker than zombies, it seems. Just reds? Yeah. Let's get that tomato juice. Oh, I think I should have killed the spiders. Do I want to kill the Nami with Carlos zombie or just run? Please be blue herbs somewhere. Not here, obviously. Maybe here? There it is. Oh, thank God. Okay, okay. Has to be item, yeah. Tomato juice. From like Super Mario. Appears that someone has already searched here. The map. It's 3rd October, 6 p.m. We'll have a party at Bar Jack. I, uh, like, unless they schedule that way ahead of September 23rd, I doubt anybody scheduled <laughs> to hang out at any bar. Is this Hirsch? No, it's not Hirsch. When I first played Outbreak, when I got to the Hive, I thought that's the doctor from the recordings. Unfinished coffee. Damn, look how big this room is here. Same thing, same thing, Gamut. Look how big it is. And then compare, like, what it's like in Outbreak. You barely fit between the table and the sofa. Director's Diary. September 10th. These patients suffer from gangrene and congestion of their blood at first. Then their mind slowly deteriorates. In the end, there is nothing left of their mind. What then happens, even mercy killing seems pointless. After all, they are already dead. This disease... This diseases... Is unlike anything I have ever witnessed. I think RE3 has the most spelling errors and shit like this. <laughs> of the first three games. Even more than the first one somehow. Once the patient's mind is gone, they become flesh hunger monsters and act like wild animals who are on some type of bloodlust. September 18th. Another patient has been admitted to the hospital. He is showing symptoms of the first stages of the disease at this point, but I haven't been able to sleep at all these past few days. I refuse to let these patients become zombies, zombies with lasers attached to their heads. I am ju not just an ordinary citizen. I am a doctor. Even if I die, my clinical charts will contribute to finding a cure. He got he got a little <laughs> he got a little uh, morale boost there. September twenty sixth, we lost most of the doctors and staff during the battle against the zomb zombie patients. It's a it's impossible to maintain the hospital under these conditions, and I know that it's too late for me. I am beginning to feel that some same itchy and hungry desire that all of my patients felt. It's too late for me. Oh. 
Oh yeah, that would I expected to find something about him when I, you know, when I understood fully. I thought, you know, maybe I here we go. So this is this is Serbian accent. It's not it's not <laughs> Russian or any other Slavic accent. This is literally how they speak. <laughs> They, I mean we, when we le learn the language. <laughs> I really hoped there would be some George reference, but there was none, no references. I am trying hard not to do the Russian accent, because this is not Russian accent. So, how does this go? I forgot. Where I go first, that is going to be the next. Where are the hunters going to be? A voice recognition lock. Oh, that's Russian. Will you push the mi microphone button? Yes. <laughs> yeah, I gotta, I gotta try to do it like Cyrillic. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> oh, that's a combo. That's a. Co I don't know if I should even attempt that combo. Here we go. Tape recorder. Check. A portable tape recorder. A patient's. Diagnosis is recorded onto this. Okay, sure. And then use. It's very hard going back. It is. Why do all these raccoon general hospital doctors have the same fancy voice? I don't get it. I do not get it. I will bring everything. I need everything. I have to kill a bunch of zombies. Where? I don't know. Patient diag diagnosis. Yes. <laughs> Which floor do I want to go first? I will go... I will go, go up first, go down first. Down we have... Gammas or Betas. I forgot. Let's go... Four. I, normally I would go B3 first, I think, huh? Let's go B3. It's gonna be very fun down there, getting destroyed by hunters. If you watched... <laughs> if you watched Stranger Things Season 4, a very famous Serbian actor plays that Yuri guy. Only Gamas, that's right. Thank you, Gamut. Hand trucks and old observation devices. So where is the cutscene gonna be? In the first place I go or second? I keep forgetting. I think in the second, yeah. So so Murphy is gonna die. M M Murphy? Uh, how would we say it? Murphy. Murphy is going to die upstairs. Large machines are built into the wall. Yeah, he was the pilot. He was the pilot. Yeah. He's a he's a very famous Serbian actor, but I was really surprised to see him there. I was like, this guy's familiar, but it didn't cross my mind. And I see like you can tell when American people or like any non like any English speaking people try to imitate like a Russian accent, you can you know when it's a Russian guy doing it. But this was definitely Serbian <laughs> English, Serbiglish. I was like Wait, this guy is familiar, but I couldn't remember. Then Sasha was like, oh, is that Nikola Juricko? I was like, what the fuck? Really is? Apparently, somehow he landed a role in Stranger Things. Bravo. Good for you, man. Nikola Juricko. Hmm. Literally nothing. Beakers and flasks. Wait, is that like a Muppet reference? No, it's just... <laughs> just because we're in a hospital. I expect something to be here. I guess he's gonna be here. Yep, here. No idea. Another guinea pig is still alive. What are you doing? Have you lost your mind? Sometimes it's easy to forget one's loyalties. Just like that traitor. You mean the guy who shot you? Yeah. Yeah, definitely. The one with the gray hair and ugly mug. I can't believe he had the guts to shoot me. Traitor! You mean Nikolai? Ah! 
He was looking for the cure, wasn't he? Like, how does he still have a face? Yeah, to us at least. Murph, you okay, Murph? Get up. Get up, man. We gotta fight. Murph, come on, Murph. Come on, buddy. Get up. Why are you peeing red, Murph? Oh, Murph. What am I gonna tell Donna, Murph? Murph's gone. I was hoping to do it, so I did it backwards. I wanted to do it the other way. I want So, this is gonna be hard upstairs. With the betas as soon as I exit this shit. Oh, I gotta I gotta shoot them quick and hope they don't headhunt me. Try to save all the HP items. Oh, this is gonna be Oh <laughs> not good. Oh look, they have their own logo, biohazard. What do we got here? The medium base. Still no green herbs. I'm gonna try to run from the gammas, actually, not even kill them. Medical instruction manual. Umbrella Medical Service, North America Division, Douglas Rover. In order to activate the synthesizer to cultivate the vaccine, please follow the procedure as detailed below. Supply enough energy to the system. Duh. <laughs> Set the medium base to the device. When the device is ready, you can start mixing the vaccine medium. To mix the vaccine, you will need to control the five levers. Levers. Levers? Levers. This will cause the two gauges to increase or decrease. If you adjust the two gauges so that they stop at the center, the vaccine medium will then be produced automatically. Taken the med instruction manual. Didn't need to read that part, but okay. I know what I took. So is there nothing here? Oh, Jesus Christ, this is going to end bad. I can only already tell. Oh... So I gotta go, when I'm escaping, I gotta do all of this to escape. And they're gonna be in front of me. Oh, do I get something if I kill Nemesis when I'm returning through the church? When he's mutated, Gamut, huh? Does he drop anything or is it just, should I just run? Forget about it. Is this the power switch? Seems to be an electric power supply switcher. It's next to the cultivation tank. Will you switch the electric power supply? Ah. Oh. I guess you gotta be one or the other, can't have two. Oh, nothing. Nice. Okay. I really want to kill him on one... So he can't... He's not still actively aiming at him. Unknown creatures are in the fish tank. So did the doctor, did the other doctor not know this is happening in the hospital? And what are the, the odds we end up at the different floors than the outbreak survivors? Fourth and B3. You don't you don't see those two, you skip them completely. The entrance. Yeah, look at the size of that hospital. <laughs> ah, okay, then I'll do that one. Yeah, okay, I can do that one. With the freeze rounds it's not as scary. Synthesizer of chemicals. Medium base can be set here. Oh, I'm in luck. I just found one. Material used to create the cultivation medium needed for the vaccine creation. It creates the vaccine and cultivation medium combined with several chemicals. Yeah. Good to see you. Good to see you, Mark. Welcome, bro. Will you operate the synthesizer? Yes. Okay, let's... So we gotta make him... We gotta dig a stuff at the center. Whoosh. Let's go below and pull A. Oh, that's not good enough. Let's go above and I'm gonna say one. There you go. Wait, are you serious? Tentacle Nemi is less dangerous than his. I like. <laughs> Last time I did this on stream, on easy mode, he grabbed Carlos and just went pow, 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 like Bam Bam from the Flintstones. <laughs> that is where the whole watch Carlos lose, say goodbye to his bones comes from. Here we go. Deep breaths, vaccine medium, and then run. I, in hindsight, I should have probably saved that. Uh, oh. Oh shit, oh I could have I could have nailed that. I've missed the door. I deserve to die. 
I thought the door was further back. Damn, I avoided them all and got slashed still. God. Fuck. Jesus. Oh. <laughs> so annoying. <laughs> Look, if you stand still, Mark, she can't see you. Their vision works on movement. Upstairs, yeah, they're gonna be upstairs, and I'm gonna have two betas upstairs, so it's very easy to die now. Oh, so bad, so bad. Yeah, it's okay. I'll just repeat everything from the... Because see, because I can't get here to blow them up. That's gonna be almost impossible. Because they're gonna corner me as soon as I get out of their room. I remember that. Very scary. Make sure that you return the materials to their original positions after inspection. Sure. It's a very small floor, the third floor. There's not even... The stairwell doesn't go here. Just like... Totally ignores this floor. Look at this. I guess it's a special wing. Where, zombie? Where are they? In the... In the... Are they in the in the room? I think they're in the room, but I gotta get the key first. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I played the remake. I beat it twice, and uh, there's nothing else left to see. After you beat it once, you already saw everything. Second time, just like when I went around on easy mode, to just to be able to look around more. It's such a poorly made game. Careful not to overuse the medicine. Well, it's called drugging then, isn't it? Hey, Mayo. Hello. Seriously? Oh. The doctor's body. He's holding a slip. The numbers 531 are printed on the slip. It's a nice slip you got there, Doc. Can I go around him and not get my foot chomped? That would be lovely. Can I keep my foot... Ah, oh, of course not. I'm asking too much. He's got a plastic sig. Ooh, sig Pro SP2009. It's mainly made of plastic and is very light. Uses 9mm parabellum rounds. That guy's still alive. Don't want him jumping me later. Four bullets left. Should be enough. There you go. Thanks for cooperating. <laughs> yeah, it's a very rushed game. So much has been missed. Like, they... It's not even just the location. There's so much missing. You see this game? Like, this playthrough alone. Some things that Zombie Chow and Senpai and Mayo and Gamut pointed out. Just some things I've never seen, even though I beat this game, like, definitely over 30 times in my life. <laughs> but just because you do things a different way, you get different outcome. I like that. But in the remake, there's none of that. You just get the same thing over and over. Something seems to have been placed here. Yeah, I remember that. Gotta push the thingy. But how do I push it? Oh, yeah, I gotta see where it is. So it's... It's gotta be mirrored. So it's gonna be all the way to the left, all right? But nothing here. No pickups, no ammo, nothing. I think I'll have to heal because as soon as I get up, two gammas just jump right out. It won't be... No gammas, sorry, betas. Two betas jump out and I won't be able to get to this and do that because they are much faster and they're... At orange caution, I'm pretty sure they can headhunt, so I'll have to heal. Do I have the key? No, I'm about to get the key. 402. Damn it. Somebody had a key. Didn't doctor had a key? Am I missing something? So you do so you do defeat Nemesis at this point, huh? Where's the key? I forgot who has the key. Where the fuck? It's not on me. In the sink? Nope, nothing in the sink. 
<laughs> yeah, I bet because of the recovery time. Wait, doesn't this guy have a key? What am I missing? Doctor's body, he's holding a slip. 531. 531 what? I forgot something here. I remember the picture and everything, but I gotta get into the room first. Let me check that. Let me check outside again. I'm missing something, most definitely. Or is it go back there to get the key? Close with this door. Oh, I don't know why I thought that was locked. I distinctly remember clicking and going. Ch -ch -ch. Are there two betas here? Yeah, this is gonna be hard. Come on. Come on. He's playing, he's playing hop hop. Damn. Just gives me heart attack for nothing. Okay, so Mayo says pistol. I don't know if I'm good enough to to pistol nemesis with 60 bullets i should be able to do it but will i survive now that's another question damn i could have used that that would have been good to know <laughs> sick room key there we go that's what i want there's gonna be two more of them when i get out photo d the zombies are walking it's about the only thing they can do again we took this from the intro <laughs> the effect of the t-virus Unknown creatures are soaked in formalin. Did you, these guys work with Chief Iron? Oh, a stink bug. Is it time? It just came out of the ceiling. R literally came out of the ceiling. Yeah, I just saw it. Like, my eyes saw it. Just struggle out of the ceiling. Between the boards. They just love the light. So I wanted Murph to die here, actually. It's the biggest choice the game gives me about that. Nothing here either. Is that where the staircase would be? I doubt. No, this is the data room. Shouldn't have a staircase. Nope. I wonder how this floor is connected to the rest of the hospital. Really, it's really eating me. You think? Hold on, guys. From through the ceiling, literally. Up No, not hornets, stink bugs. And it's sprayed, and it smells awful. Ugh. I caught it, but it was too late. Oh, God. Ugh. Just horrible. So there's nothing else here. I don't think I'll find anything. I keep hoping to find something. Ugh. <laughs> yeah, stink bug. That's what I said. It's stink and bug. Very not good. 402. Well, the only sick room we can't get into. You didn't have to tell me that. Ugh. Well, they can call it whatever. Just, I don't like them. They attack the senses. It's not polite. Oh, I think it's an Arkley Mountains picture, right? Before it falls off, I want to see it. Yeah. Literally the shot from the first game's intro. <laughs> Gotta love that. If you do it wrong, you get zapped. Oh, they didn't kill it, but they they stink as soon as their life is threatened, literally. I just caught it gently, but it decided to release the smell. Ugh.
Why, yeah, why do they call him Stinky Martin? Who's Martin? Oh, you did. Oh, nice, nice, Mark. I'll check it out. Oh, I hope it's not my reaction to the stink bug. Lock with a number base lock. Five one three was it? Nope. Five three one. I'm gonna try to remember now. Three five one. Oh no, it is five three one. Vaccine base. All right, we got two, two components. Let's go make vaccine for Jill. Core material used to create vaccine. It needs to be fixed with the vaccine medium. Is that it? Vaccine that is affecting against the virus infection. Okay. Man, now it's gonna be a little tricky. Uh, should I even try to shoot? I could fuck this up. Fuck it. Let's play it safe. Since I didn't save... Yeah, there you go, zombie. There you go. I wanted to leave them for Nemesis and try to beat him, but... I like how the assault rifle pushes them back. It's very good. And since we're leaving... So long. Whoosh! Now there's gonna be a bunch of zombies outside. Yeah, he is. He is. Never! Never! Bam, the never gun does work the best when you scream never. How did they enter here? How, how did they end up here? Can somebody tell me? Literally one pack of two packs of ammo and and two red greens. That's that's all you find with this guy. Kind of feels well, still not as bad as the remakes. Uh Hospital Siege part that's really annoying oh look he even had three more increments like why do you expect me to save three times six times in total in this section but not heal more than twice or get the okay first aid spray i guess it counts not if you don't want to use it like some people and i have the knife i mean i'll have to try to practicing the knife in these old games it's just scary and daunting really to be honest Nothing. I keep hoping I'll find something. Where's the Alyssa drawer now to be unlocked? Various medicines are placed here. Yeah, but we know that one of them is has things in it. Show us. Show us what it is. Save. Let's not forget to save. I feel... Slippery. Oh, uh, the 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 version you were talking about, Mayo, the the modded one, the super hard, the one that Senpai was playing. I don't need to drop it. Not that I'll find anything new. Ooh, ooh! I gotta make sure. Uh, I think it's too late for that. I gotta make sure I got all the files. Seems to be a time-based bomb. What if you don't make it in five seconds, huh? <laughs> There's another cutscene I love, I love very much. Here we go. That's Nikolai, just going around Raccoon City in his final moments, placing time bombs. The hospital, the university, take it all down. Never mind, we're gonna nuke everything. Just keep blowing shit up. Nikolai sent sent by Michael Bay for the best explosions. 
Goodbye, hospital. There was a hospital here, but it's gone now. <laughs> it reminds me of the Silent Hill 2 comment. <laughs> Every time. There was a hole here, but it's gone now. The, the, the compass just seems seems weird, doesn't it? It's out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it does feel like that. Okay, it's time to say goodbye to my bony bones. This place is gonna crumble on itself. Doesn't need Nikolai to do it. Sorry. Just keep eating. I'm not gonna interrupt your meal. Seems tasty from here. Fuck the spiders now, fuck everything. Charge! Oh, they're still here. Eat a non-poisonous dick. Uh, bye. I wonder if I can go to the other room to save. Anything there? No. Can I go here to save? I gotta try. Oh, that's him. He's angry. Do I want to take him down? Let's let's see if I can. This is more like a personal challenge than anything. Anybody there? I mean, this battle wasn't easy for me on on easy either, honestly. I hear a Cerberus. No thanks. Nothing. I I bet there's nothing worth ma mauling in there. Hmm. It's like he's banging on the floor. Like the... Like the... like, I guess you mean Italian accent? Like New York? <sighs> well, nothing stopping me from trying. Charge! Slow-mo entrance. Ruah. Isn't this form way more fun than uh, than the remake's dog form? No dodge! Oh fuck! That's what I'm afraid of. I suck at the timing for this. I gotta still gotta practice. Dodge, night. Damn. Oh, here we go. What the hell? What the fuck? I never did that. I never did that on easy <laughs> with the pistol, let alone let alone on hard. What the hell? Did I just annoy him to leave me? God. Do I try again? I mean, what's the worst that can happen? Seven bullets left. Oh, so uh, should I should I take him out or should I? Hmm. Should I take him out or should I not? Yeah. Oh shit! I couldn't dodge that. Aha. Oh shit. Bad timing. Get up, get up, get up. Shit. Can't dodge here, apparently. There you go. Shit. Ooh, okay, still alive. Shit, still got me. Oh, 
Oh, cool. I've never seen that, really. So what if he reaches her? So I wonder what happens if he reaches her. I can I can survive this completely. I never knew I never knew about this. This is another new thing for me. Oh god. Oh really? So I gotta kill him before that, huh? There you go. Is he down? Did it do it? Is he gonna get up? Nope. Oh bravo me! Amazing. I didn't know about that. Cool. Thanks, Mayo. I never would have thought of using a pistol on the fucking tyrant. The the worst of the worst tyrants. Jesus Christ. This game still surprises me so many things in this playthrough. Thank you so much, guys. I don't know how to thank you for all the things you bestowed upon me. This just made the game so much better than it was. There we go. Jill, you're saved. And he's like sleeping in front of the door. Remember last time on Easy Zombie? When he just... I th we have a clip of that. He just kept lashing her around. I mean him. Wow. With a pistol. <laughs> uh, barely made it. How do you feel? Yeah, I would think that, especially with the SIG, the plastic what pistol. To you? I just fought with that monster. Uh, oh. I've got some bad news. Nikolai's still alive. But I thought he was dead. <laughs> that guy doesn't know the meaning of the word dead. What is he after? I don't know. All I know is that he is our enemy. I'm sorry, Jill, but there's something I gotta take care of. I promise I'll meet up with you later. But don't worry. I'm still, like, I'm still living through the fact that I... Oh, nice. Oh, that's pretty cool. Let's see what we have. Let's see. Ooh, this is really bad with all the other ammo, though. Still have these herbs. I'll bring a blue and try to just blow through the spiders. That's undodgeable. Okay, okay. This I should make. I mean, I'm gonna play it more on hard mode now. Obviously, this is pretty good. This makes the game double everything I knew. Oh yeah, I'll bring these. Fuck it. I didn't use them at all. Just bring all this shit. It's gonna be useful in a moment. Keep the flame ones, I guess. What are the flame ones? Good. Gammas. That's right. I'm gonna use those on gammas. I'm out of ammo, though. Otherwise. She will fight the nemesis now, won't she? And he's gonna drop something for her. Here we go. This should be enough for everything I want to do. I really thought this was gonna be a lot harder. Just one health item was enough for this. Just totally different strategizing that I'm used to. Well, I mean, on easy mode, you just charge in with a fucking assault rifle that has two clips, I think, along with it. You just charge into everything. Never! Alright. Let's fight. He's gonna walk in through the window now or something, right? Hi. Oh yeah, this is where I wanted to fight him actually. That's it. There you go. So so strong these he seems weaker than before is he he's faster but weaker 
Yeah, I hope so. Did I get the infinite bullets? Did he just drop fucking infinite bullets? Are you shitting me? Whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. Does this mean you can make anything infinite? What you make in the can I make infinite freeze rounds? Like Okay. Does it lower my grade if I use this? Are you shitting me? I didn't know this is I knew about the weapon parts, but this when combined with a weapon. An unlimited number of bullets become available. Yeah, it's what it says. I'm not dreaming this. Thanks, buddy. You'd think he hate me by now, but he just keeps treating me to good toys. What should I use it with? I'll... Magnum. Maybe with a Magnum. That sounds reasonable. Is there anything outside? That's what Nemesis dropped for me. The infinite bullets, sis. I just want to check something. I think this one's blocked too, but let's see. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it wasn't enough. I remember this like <laughs> made me shit my pants. Again. It wasn't enough that he can walk from room to room, but he also breaks that door and it's like two rooms are combined now. So the whole time game you were just joking with us when we had to load through that door. You knew we didn't have to. Those two rooms are one room. No, I'm, I never actually killed him. I only played this on hard mode once. And I never killed him. Like, well, I didn't kill him on maybe two locations where I only, only where I needed to. Because I just kept running. I realized you can run from here. There are spiders here. Yar, there be spiders here. Okay. I didn't check. Ah, shit! I forgot to check the some things with the uh, the lockpick. I forgot the lockpick. That's what I need. Yeah, I didn't check this with Carlos. He would have. He would have known him, I think, or said like something. My comrade. Yeah, it's my bad. I gotta go back for the lockpick. And you are missing something. I just couldn't remember what. Like, I have all the bullets. So, zombie, mayo, anyone, what do you say? Does this lower the grade if you put the infinite bullets? And what would you put it on? Like, what would you combine it with? I wonder. Go with a shotgun, with a magnum, with a grade launcher? Should be a assault rifle cheater? What does that mean? Magnum. So not the grand launcher with freeze rounds, because that sounds like pretty cool. You can freeze shit. Oh wow. Like to me guys, this is like this is as if ah, I had a I had a box before there. I'm just so excited. This is as if I got a new version of RE3, like an updated one. Okay, let's get that. I'll think about what to mix this with. Just gonna think real hard. No need for this since no spiders. Yeah, but I'm asking you, what would you do? So you would do it with Magnum, right? I think I'm well equipped to tackle a few zombies. You don't have enough exclamation marks there, zombie. <laughs> it's a piano, Jill. Go around it. She feels so light and fast. Both after Leon and Claire and after Carlos. Beretta. <laughs> yeah, go with that. Cool. That's very, very cool.
But like the main question, zombie, is does it lower your grade, or is it like at this point the games like have fun? Oh look, the zombies are gone. I guess they ate and left. Very cultured zombies. Should kill both of them, right? Yeah, there you go. Should blow up when they come across it, right? You can't reload it. Yeah, it's pretty cool. But you gotta reload it manually, that's weird. Let's try one more time. Yep. Ah, that's why, that's why, okay. Then I'll try not to use it, but it, it's tempting, I gotta say. Was there a hospital there? Yep. She confirmed it. All right. Let's check, actually. I'm gonna check. I'm really curious about this. Because it would be weird to just... Hmm. RE3. Nemesis. Infinite. Ammo. Drop. Infinite bullet, there you go. Just a second, I'm really curious about this. I don't know if he can just drop fucking infinite bullets. From the second playthrough. From the second playthrough onwards on hard mode. Seventh encounter, which is what we did. After playing as Carlos and giving the antivirus vaccine to Jill, while having defeated in every other encounter up to that point. So, like, what we did with... Thanks, is What we did with... Uh, in the restaurant and with a cable, it counts like a defeat, I guess. Okay, it would be the rifle otherwise. Can be only used once. Any kind of rounds when using the grenade launcher. That, that's what I'm going with. If you combine it with a mine thrower, they become heat seeking missiles. This is just golden. Wow, that's really cool. You get heat seeking missiles. Huh. Doesn't say anything about lowering your grade, though. Yeah, I think that's only an RE2. That's very interesting. Let's make a fucking infinite grenade launcher. I'm gonna have some fun with it. So, grenade launcher or seat hitting... Seat hitting? <laughs> heat seeking missiles. Both sound very, very detractive. Yeah, grenade launcher, huh? Next time we'll do the heat sinking missiles. This is fucking gold. I am I'm ecstatic. <laughs> There's a file and ink ribbon, I think. Photo E. The zombies are attacking. This one was taken black and white for some reason. Yes, this this is like I thought I knew everything about this game. I keep saying that. Like I played it so many times, there's not much left to see. The epilogues, okay, I wasn't too heavy on the epilogues. It's not really... It's just text. And this time I thought, you know what? I could get all the epilogues. But then I got so much more. It's insane. 
you'll see what we're talking about so a couple of us said here that we're not really thrilled about the re3 remake it dropped a lot from the original some of those so there's no you don't visit the clock tower you don't visit the park you, you seek the clock tower from afar you don't visit the gas station you also see that from afar it's very short game it's missing all of this stuff <laughs> it's a key for the main gate of the raccoon park yeah that's why i keep saying you know the, my whole life i thought easy mode is normal mode why would they make hard mode normal mode but apparently they would uh so i'm gonna pack this up I'm gonna keep this for now I don't know if I'll need it so we don't need anything any of this anymore it kind of gets like at this point it gets to be easier on hard mode than on easy mode you know what I mean wait Magnum ammo grain launcher yeah that's it so I'm gonna bring these two and bring that infinite ammo thing just go wild I guess And should be able to load all the rounds. Combine. Here we go. Zoop. Waha. Freeze rounds. And I just combine any rounds you want. As long as you have one. Problem solved. <laughs> Charge. All right. I guess the game's like you earned it, buddy. You did all that? Go. Run wild, run free. I'm gonna go like a crazy person, go like, ah, 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 burn everything, freeze everything. Hot, cold, hot, cold. Raccoon Park. Hello, Raccoon Park. I can't tell if that's happiness or. Oh, these guys don't like fire. I guess fire hurts them more than ice. Where is it? I'm gonna guess it's over here. Come on, guy. Sounds like he's stuck. What am I shooting at? Oh, there he is. Fuck that. Zombie, be happy for me, man. This is all new for me. Someday, only for you, I'm gonna play on ultra hard with one HP the entire game, and the only weapon is gonna be a toothpick. I guess we go down here first, I think. Yeah, to get the key. Zombie wants me to struggle <laughs> with a fork in my eye, just like trying to get them with my head. There should be gammas here, right? Not so scary now, when I got the fire. I'm gonna freeze the next guy. Two cold, one froze. <laughs> one can wish, huh? <laughs> Freeze, asshole. We're playing hot and cold here. Let's freeze explode that barrel. Wait, wait, this is where we're gonna escape later. Maybe I need it. This is really good. Really, really good. He's holding something. What is he holding? Jilly? Jilly Willy? 
Written order to the supervisors. Mission requirements. Bravo 16. 1. Obtain and secure sample of all the information pertaining to this case. Observe and record combat data on the UBCS. So, they literally sent in their own army that they made, like a little private army. They sent them in to be butchered and just to, you know, get data on the bioweapons. Like, how did they perform against armed and trained personnel? It's really sick. I love it. <laughs> Two, destroy all the evidence, including the medical facility that has the medical treatment data. So that's why Nikolai blew up the hospital. Three, check the guinea pig's ability to accomplish the mission. Once your, who's the guinea pig here? Are UBCS or the bioweapons? Once your mission is complete, evacuate immediately. No, evacuate the area. Remember that you must not help anyone who is not a supervisor, nor bring anything back that might be traced to where it belongs. So what if you... What if you escape with, uh, with a rocket in your in your ass, like Nikolai says? What? What? Wait, wait, wait! What's romantic? No trespassing beyond this point. It's the rear gate of the Raccoon Park. It's locked. There should be. Uh, let me see, remember. Is there a file of a dead guy? Come on, head. Work with me. Nope. Am I missing some files? I didn't even check. Okay, so far everything's here. What was the park? Park key. No check. It's a key given from a mercenary. It says Raccoon Park Graveyard. Okay, Graveyard key. Love the rain. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. Whoa. You okay, kitty? The map's gonna be in the next room, yeah. Anything here? No? Can't read that. And some health, health items. At this point, like with this, don't really need them. Well, you do. You fuck up, you're still dead. That's the map. It's okay, cat. Damn it. Just pushing your leg in my face. There's the hospital. Well, most of the park is inaccessible, really. As is the fashion in these Resident Evil games. Like, look at all this building. You can just go here. But yeah, so I want to go to the graveyard, which is here. But I won't be able to go from here yet. Which herbs you got there? Oh, nice. It is the outer edge of the disc that's worn out. I checked today before stream, I cleaned it. I also know because when you reset the console, it you don't even see, you probably saw it if you were there at the start. Because I always start with the console startup screen. You don't even get to see what happens, it just zero loads instantly. But at the end of the at the edge of this disc apparently it's not that good. I didn't need to bring that herb, I don't know why I did that, but now we're here. So all these configurations, the shape of the fountain changes based on the combination of the gears. Which makes no sense in reality, like no machine can work like this. Why does it matter which gear you put, the black or the white one? How does that change how the fountain works? It doesn't. <laughs> but it does in the world of Resident Evil. Which is why we love it. Okay. To refer to the illustration to drain the pool. So, black upper right, white down. Well, I gotta get another one in that case. But this is, it's not horrible as these discs can go. That's it.
Yeah. Like some of them get worn out with time. I already changed the Resident Evil 1 disc, I think. Once. And even the new one is not... Well, the new one. The one I got in England two years ago. It wasn't three years ago now. Wow, time flies. It's still froze near the end of the game but this playstation wants to load it apparently the one with the better laser this is gonna be the domain of snakes oh my god the snakes not the eel snakes where is it is it gonna oh no that's where they are are those little grave diggers? Ah. Let's burn them all. I always wanted to check that. There you go. That one just iframed. Nothing else. I don't use flame rounds nearly as much as I should in any Resident Evil game. Here lies James Otto, a loving memory of his family. Let's read the graves. Nothing there. Nice, splashes to the other guy as well. Cool down. You mean the grave digger? Damn, I want to come back for this, so I gotta, I just gotta not pick up the key. Nice. Catches multiple zombies. I think the bad side of uh, infinite bullets is you don't get to improve them really. Well, maybe if I keep making these. The freeze rounds, they'll get better. I wonder. So I never tried leveling up the flame rounds. Really curious what that's going to be like. Oh shit, it's doing the thing. There we go, okay, don't scare me like that. Guess it needed to load the door texture. Nice, there we go, that's what I want. But at first, before anything I want, yeah, it's in the other room. The item box. Pumpkins. It's the first batch of magnum bullets you find in the game. We're not gonna need this for now, I think. Leave those. Well, we're gonna need... Not for now, at least. Bring acid. That's it. Let's go do it. Combine these with the reds we found there. I think it was the reds. A dried up, uh, a dried up pumpkins are placed here. This is what I'm talking about. Why so many spelling errors? I just think it was rushed because it was supposed to be a side game, not the main game, or so they say. Ink ribbon. It looks like there's an ink ribbon. I think it's just a smudge on the table. We're gonna want these. I'm gonna make CC again. Screw it.
<laughs> Just blows up in my hand as I'm combining it. <laughs> Can you read these? No. That's not all tombstones are equally important. That looks like there has been an exit. There was an exit there some time ago. Yeah, it would go straight. Well, there's there, it's it's the lake here, so I guess not. Nope, not important. What about here? Still not important. Beloved Odo. Alfred Coons, 1923 to 1986. Why are these names important? Is it just like flavor text or is there something to this? Never heard of Alfred Coons outside RE3. I think it's just supposed to be like to enrich the story. Anybody else outside? So just Alfred and Otto. I thought there were more names. But I thought a lot of things that turned out to be not to be true. This time it just loaded in first try. Let's go here. Just making him stronger. I know they're infinite. <laughs> I want him to be super boosted. For the ultimate stun lock. Alright. So much more stuff. Okay, pretty good. Four red greens at this point. I'm getting confident enough that I think I could do it. I could do it without... Um, Without infinite ammo, actually. The park would be a little tricky. Because of the lack of ammo there. Just before that point. But yeah, I'll need the lighter, damn it. Let me in, room. Kitty. Settle down. I knew I'll need the lighter for one more thing. And it's this thing. No, not that thing. This thing. Yeah, let's do that first, actually. There's a f there's firewood which... Wait, 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 read it. There's firewood which could catch on fire. <laughs> Wind is blowing in from the back of the fireplace. The way, the way she said it, like, could catch fire. You no longer need this lighter. There you go. Goodbye, lighter. A light can be seen from the back of the fireplace. How did they enter there, really? So we're gonna see now. Maintenance tools are placed here. Iron pipe. I always think she's gonna play it like a flute. An iron pipe for gas piping. It's tough and long enough to be used as a pry. Which is, luckily, exactly what I need. Right in the room where I need it.
that that position she ends up in like she's resting supervisor's report the endurance ability of the contain contaminated guinea pigs is truly incredible so yeah it's the bioweapons that are guinea pigs even when shot in a vital area they sometimes survive for several days without taking care of the wound however after prolonged exposure to the virus the guinea pigs intelligence level decreases to that of an insect even though reviving the dead seems too disgusting the virus may still be of use if we inject the virus into our POWs and release them, they would return to their units and then turn into zombies. This plan may work well for us in the future. That is so sick. So basically getting the prisoners of war, infecting them, releasing them back and having them decimate, decimate your own enemy with their own forces. In certain areas, the virus seems to have caused the mutation of animals and plants. It may be difficult, but it will make a good sample for the bioweapon development. I've heard that there is a giant alligator, but I have only encountered a giant creature moving underground. So they're talking about the about the the RE2 alligator, I'm sure. I don't even want to imagine that creature what creature spawned that monster. I encountered Nemesis. If I didn't know about it, I'd have been contaminated and would have become one of them by now. If it is still walking around in the city, its mission is not yet over. STARS members must be very tough since they have survived until this point. However, they cannot hold out forever. Right, supervisor report, here we go. No, oh, more of these. Now we have all the grenades. Well, we had explosive grenades before, just not using them. Seems to be a place to store weapons. So how did this work? How did they enter and leave this secret room? They surely they didn't go through the fucking fireplace every time they needed to, because that would be bonkers. I think the cutscene is going to be after I take the key. Facts from the HQ. Attention, the Raccoon City project has been abandoned. Our political maneuvering in the Senate to delay, their plans are now futile. All supervisors should evacuate immediately. The U.S. Army is going to execute their plan tomorrow morning. The city will be obliterated at daybreak for sure. I mean, <laughs> see, it's like someone was here just now. It says tomorrow morning. Do they put the bricks back every time? It's set to the auto-receive mode. And this guy here is dead. Like, seriously, what the hell? You can see umbrella stuff in there. Yeah, you know what I mean? Like <laughs> every time having to stack the bricks, pretending you're you're the grave guy, the grave digger, I guess. Not the boss, the actual person that digs graves. It's crazy. Like this is gonna be I feel this is gonna be a shorter episode because there's so little left. Another part key. A small key with an iron ring attached to it. It says rear gate on the ring. That's the key we need to escape, that's right. Hey Delmar, welcome to the stream, buddy. All supervisors, mission terminated. Return immediately. Repeat. All supervisors return immediately. Over. Surely, Trollosharsh. It's going great, Poche. I just found out this game has fucking infinite bullets drop from Nemesis. I'm so happy about it. I put it on the grenade launcher. So I'm gonna spray grenades until it's... Okay, I'm gonna burn this house down. Look look at me burning shit down. So long, hot. It's catching, catching fire. If I keep at it, I'm gonna burn it. How are you doing, guys? Woo! I, I'm supposed to make. Yeah, it's here, isn't it? I'm quite impressed you've managed to stay alive up until now. Oh, really, comrade? And you seem to be doing a pretty good job of looking out for yourself. 
How about helping out? I have no intention of helping you. Because we're nothing but pawns in all this? In a manner of speaking, you are. Our employers wanted a detailed analysis of the zombie beings which were created through infection by the T-Virus. You're saying that they deliberately sent in a military unit to be butchered by their creations? Not exactly. Although the conditions encountered on this operation were extreme, it was an unexpected outcome that the team would be wiped out. We were only required to collect live data from the subjects. Ah! Another mutant! Another mutant. Here we go, Joe. Stein. I'm actually gonna shave here because why the hell not? I've shaved so many times, doesn't matter at this point. But I am very, very tempted to do a dish as a no-shave like Resident Evil 2 now with all this new newfound knowledge. It would be very fun to do. Shit, I need to think of more sentences with Ash in them so I can shun Connery properly. What, another mutant? <laughs> you can shave your progress here. We'll use the ink ribbon. Yes, I will. She 11 shave. Oh my god, it's a new record. Graveyard. Here we go. Let's go, Joe. Let's go, Nabash, a mutant. Just funny how he says this. Another mutant. <laughs> uh, his voice in the remake. So the new Nikolai, I think it's one of the top things about uh, both <laughs> both uh, RE3 remake and Resistance. I just love hearing his voice. That actor did a good job. And he's also the voice actor for one of the RE8 main guys. I forgot his name. Uh, Heidinger, Heidegger, something like that. A very good comrade. Charge! Oh, that's just rude. I said charge! What's going on? Whoa! Surf's up, dude. It's a funny thing they called him Gravedigger. He, you end up fighting him on the graveyard. Whoa! Does it still make him retreat? No, it doesn't. Still fine and dandy. You would have expected more damage from this guy. Eat on this, sucker. Oh shit, I'm gonna get fucked. Shit. Shit fuck. Is it dead? Is dead. Shit. That was pretty... Pretty sweet. Bleh. He, 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 he's a cousin of Jan, obviously. Same melting purple animation. <laughs> Same type of bioweapon. I'm melting. I'm melting. Just a puddle. That's a bit of a How are they standing? That makes no sense. How are the fucking lampposts made of titanium? Like they should have when the with the urge. It doesn't make sense, but okay. I love this game despite all the weird stuff. I could escape by climbing up this fence. Will you climb up? No, just stay there forever. It's a solid plan. You got yourself a fort there, Jill. A very nice private fort. Charge! Oh, jeez, I didn't expect that. 
They shouldn't release babies when you hit them with that. How about the freeze? What does the freeze do to them? That's new. I don't remember. I know. That's, I guess one of hard mode 50-50s. I just thought that the only thing you can see here is the tarantulas. Oh, no, I mean the, the eels. I meant the eels. Oh, shit. No! Don't come this way! Uh, I gotta kill you, buddy. Freeze, asshole. Thank you, Luca. Should have. Let's leave the fountain running. All four of them, huh? So, two diagonal. Okay. Just good manners. You want to wash that felt? I think it's like this. There you go. There you go. Free ba free bath for everyone. Raccoon City Fountain. Whoosh. Ah. Wish you could turn on all five of them, but it's the middle one is separated. Hunters? Is it hunters time? Oh no, it's zombies. Do I have explosive ones? They they would be good for these. I, I want to try all the rounds. All the rounds, Morty. Shit, I can't see shit. Just melts them. Let's do the fire combo. Down, boy. Down. Everybody down. Burn! Burn, motherfucker, burn! You know what? Let's combine fire and acid. Maybe we'll make a new effect. Charge! Oh shit, I melted this BP. That must have hurt. Everybody in Alivadi, yes. <laughs> Oh, this is fun. This is very fun. Just melt. I'm melting. Please give me more gammas now. I want to take out all the frustration. Fire. I wonder if they're weak to ice as well. Because they're amphibians. Should be like very bad for them. I think there should be two or three gammas here. Let's try it. Hopefully. Or no, it's when you're coming in. We'll see. There's no one here. Oh, that sucks. I was hoping for a boom boom. Fire with fire. Oh, that was cool. Oh, that was pretty cool. I never tried that. <laughs> Blowing it up with the flame round. Very nice. And, like, everything's changed since the rain stopped. I love it. Imagine bringing all the keys. I think I did that once as a kid. I was I didn't discard a single key. Just kept stacking them. Had a great collection of keys in my item box. It is time. Zombie, jump down. Which one? Which one kills Nikolai? I think if you jump down. Fuck it. I'm just gonna try to jump down. Not sure if that's the same thing I did last time. Nothing here. That looks like should have been a map for this area. Kind of reminds me of flashback scenario from file 2. I'll break file 2. No. I think if you jump down you get the chance to kill Nikolai. No. Though we did do that last time. I don't know. We'll see. I mean killing Nikolai. I don't remember if I jumped or not. Push him off or jump off. You know what? Fuck you buddy. I don't want to play with you. 
dodge. Rawr. He's like, damn, she's crazy. Really? Down is easier? I thought down is harder. He just gave up. It reminds me of that part in RE0 near the end. Very nice. Would have been nice to have more natural environments. Like RE3 gives us the most of everything. You know, because one is 90% inside, indoors. Two. Two is. Well, yeah. Very little city, but that's where we got the first taste of Raccoon City. Wait, will I be able? I just want to see where I am before I go anywhere. Does this count still as park? Yeah, still counts as park. So this whole section I should have not, shouldn't have had it, right? Was that the bridge? I guess that was the bridge. Because I went there. Oh, no, no. No, this was the bridge. Doesn't count as a... Doesn't show as a... Doesn't show that I've been there. Damn, it's hard to talk. But yeah, that's it. It's going to be done very soon. Much sooner. I thought maybe I'll need four hours. I don't know why. Because how slow the other areas went. Oh, Jesus, fuck. Sound is scary. Ah, oh, I wish I climbed up. Down there. Oh, there we go. How does he do that with a rifle? A full -time job. Thanks, Carlos. Screw you, buddy. You. Listen closely, Jill. They're going to launch a missile directly into the city as soon as day breaks. At dawn? But, but that's only... You just read about that. We don't have much time left. She just read about it. We have to split up and find a way out of here. And hey, watch out for that traitor Nikolai. What frame drop? <laughs> huh, so two doors. I'm gonna guess I gotta go here first. Just wait, where did they come from? No. I I'm not sure where he came from. Uh, I think it's just the game trying to be epic. Just the same with Nikolai before. Not Nikolai, sorry. Nemesis, when he busts into the clock tower, it goes like 10 frames per second. I think it's just trying to be slow-mo. As best as it could, because they I don't think they could have added motion blur here. That looks like a file to read. I love files to read. Oh right here. Yeah, that's why you said it was easier. Security manual. Security of the plant. I would have thought it's they meant like a plant, you know, like not a factory, not but like a green plant. Oh thanks love. The tea was magnificent. It really perked me up. Nice. Since this plant is a facility under the disguise of a deserted factory, the civilians will sometimes enter. If this should occur, do not hesitate to shoot them. <laughs> like, full on evil. <laughs> not even like, pretend to be like, uh, protecting the dilapidated factory, anything. Just like, fucking shoot them. No one's gonna investigate. We got the police in our hands. If they choose to surrender, arrest, and then transfer them to the laboratory as new guinea pigs. <laughs> You will be rewarded. <laughs> Maintenance of the device. This entire plant is controlled by an epidemic prevention system. Very bad one, apparently. When contamination is detected in the treatment room or decomposed, decomposed specimen pool, the plant will automatically be locked down for isolation. In that case, you must follow the manual to unlock it. If the contamination is over the limit, the whole system will automatically lock down. Then you must remain in the plant and wait for subsequent orders. Those who leave the facility without permission will suffer extreme consequences. Hello, hello. Hi, Wesky. Thanks for the raid, my man. What's everyone doing? Hello, Wesky. Hello, Simon. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, everyone. Welcome to the original RE3. Zoop. One, two, three, four. Oh, damn it. Prof. Wesker, not Wetsker. There you go. 
I just renamed you to Wetzker. Wetzker! Resistance. How is Resistance treating you? Are you Were you killing some survivors? <laughs> How's everyone doing, guys? Oh, Ink Ribbon. I love those. All dead. Everybody's dead, Morty. So you had fun, huh? That's the most important thing. So this is... Yeah, we get the water sample right away. Nothing more. Ooh, nice. How long did it take you, I wonder? Claire A. Like from start to finish, or did you have a save game? You can't do shout out without him saying something? I don't know what that means. Veteran. Veteran instruments? As opposed to noob instruments, I guess? Wait, which room is this? How am I lost? How, so how long? Like two, three hours, four hours? Okay, this is where we are. I think that's where I want to go first. Yeah, pretty sure. So you did it with saving, I hope. I mean, I hope. I assume. I don't hope. Experiment related notes. Watch out for the portion with no wave when adjusting the data. Yeah, this is the puzzle that I like. And not everybody does. From what I hear, at least. Oh, really? That's weird. Well, I, I gave him a shout-out already, so that's okay. Oh, yeah. It le looks like after RE3, they just went... They're just gonna go down with those remakes. Not in a good way. Let's make all C's. No need for anything else. Since we're going gonna make the ultimate freeze rounds. I think it's gonna be stronger if I mix it with the uh, explosive rounds though. Hmm. Ult ultraviolet razor being applied to the water. There's a tiny slot where a plastic card could fit. Water pollution alert. Blocking of the abolition area passage is now in progress. To maintain safety, the lock will not be released until a manual check has been performed, which is just like cheat on it. Device to check the water quality. A water sample seems to be required. Pronounce me like one of your French girls. Oh, I do have a water sample. Here we go. Here we go. Sample from the treated drainage of this factory. It shows it has passed the water pollution test. But still, so this is cheating what we're doing. We just are doing to get our goal. Now we cut to stack them. Oh yes, take the rocket launcher. We need to blow shit up. There is a device to check the water quality. Will you operate it? Yes. Thanks for repeating that for me, game. So, could we mix the infinite bullets with the rocket launcher? Will that work? Which wave range will you adjust? Uh, let's see. I have to focus now. Definitely not here. Hmm. See, like this. This too. The lower one does not work. So I need to adjust C, actually. Yeah, I really like playing this game as a kid. It's true. I think I should have gone left. 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 Still not good. Still not good, but we're getting there. 
So I need back to B, I'm gonna say. Let's keep pushing, see what happens. Like so. Still not good, but we're getting there. Let's adjust A now. Like so. Still not good? No. No. No, no. Mm, no. That looks like the best solution. Let's go back to B now. Or had a C? No, no. Like this? Uh, still one extra. Merde. No. No. One of them cannot be double. Oh, I know. I think I know. Maybe it's even A? But we'll see. Are you crazy, Professor Vascar? No, really, dude. I, I admire your courage. I was saying earlier to Mayo and Zombie and Senpai how it's cool that we can share stuff like this now, this way. Wouldn't be able to do that ten years ago. I think I see what's wrong here. It's it's A. So one, two, one, two. Let's try to move A. Three, but not two. Fuck. One of that those needs to be like that. So B cannot be where it is. Definitely, I see that now. B, right, right. One, two, one. One, two, three. So all three need to be up. That's that's the tell. Where there's three of them, stack all three, and it'll fall into place. One, two, three. One, two. But still three there where I don't want them. Two. Has to be this. Still one extra there. So two. One. Three. Two. Two. But that one's not good now. Ah! We'll get there. What if... No, that's not it. One of them needs to be down here. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was saying. I got nothing against this puzzle. I actually enjoy it. No, I didn't want to push that. We destroyed the water. It's game over. We fucked the water up. Everyone's gonna die. <laughs> no shit, it's different. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. So, one, two, one, two. Somebody sees it? Sees something that I'm missing here? Don't don't hesitate to speak. Not gonna bite you. Got there. That one's good, that one's good. I'm gonna say it's up to you, B. Here we go. But I need three there. Like this. One, two, one. One, two, still missing one. We got two and one there. We got one there. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Two, but we don't need two over there. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Two and one. Still not good. A <laughs> uh, man can hope. Uh huh. One, two. I think it's A, actually. I keep insisting on these, but it's gonna turn out to be A in the end. Wait, wait, wait. That's still three. Fuck. Three, one, three, two, two. Oh, 
How about now? Three, two, two. Oh, that's still three over there. Shit. Move along, A. Eh? Yeah, A is always gonna have something there if I want want it to be the way it needs to be. So it's definitely not A. Still, one, two, three, one, two, one, two. One of them is extra. Which one is it? Now is the time to pay attention. One left for C. Yeah. No, not cancel. Fuck. Can't skip this. Gonna rub it. Did it at least save? No. And then I gotta hear it again. <laughs> Just to show you where you fucked up. So A is definitely not good now. Oh, right. 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 So A is definitely here. There's no nothing else for A. We know that much. Can't put it anywhere else that it's not good. That it's good, I mean. So two there, one there. C, gotta move along. Oh, I thought I was doing C. B, I'm gonna say is good, but I'm gonna check C, keep pushing, see where we end up now, no, 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 three, two, but no two there. Yeah, it's gotta be B. Because whatever I do with C, it's not good. We get three, we get two, but there's an extra there. See what I mean? Yeah, so I think it's B that needs to be adjusted. Because <laughs> I missed you, zombie. Um, of course it's going to go like this when I say I love this puzzle. So one, two. One. It's going to be three. Ah, yeah, it's B now, definitely. I think I got it. I think I got it. Here we go. Just move along. That one's not good. That one's not good. Should have gone left, really. There you go. Two, one. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Three. Not good. I think C now. Two, one. That one's no extra. Fuck. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> mm. One, three, two, two. B is not good. Is B good now? Yep. That, 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 I think that's it. We got it. It looks like that's it. Check. There we go. Yeah, okay. Water quality check has passed the safety level. Just because we cheated. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. It was unlucky. <laughs> I love this puzzle. Oh, look, I'm stuck on this puzzle. Nothing else here. Oh, we'll be back here later. Oh, wait, is there something on the board? <laughs> I think I tried to read that. Experiment-related notes, yeah. For what I was doing, game. Not, not good, obviously, but I was doing it. Run, Jill. Just a little bit left, Jill. You're gonna escape. Then you're gonna tell everyone what happened here. No one's gonna believe you. Yet. Oh, we're gonna have some drain Dimas. Or Betas. Neither are good, really. I wanted to actually level up the grenades using this. But just keep the explosive grenades. Because Ah, oh, you had to do that, did you now? <laughs> there. Just as long as I have one, it's gonna be good. <laughs> Thanks, Wesky. Oh,
You go back there. So Magnum, Grand Launcher, Ammo. We're not going to use the explosive ones. Really no need with all, all of these. That's it. Don't need anything else of the key items. Special weapons. Barely use that shotgun. No shotgun shells past that point. I guess the game just wants me to make some. Charge! Imagine dying now after all of this. <laughs> no, don't do that now. Don't, don't you dare. I just did that fucking puzzle once. Enough. It's gonna try again, I'm sure. It wouldn't freeze here, would it? Okay, here we go. I heard that. You can hear when the laser like, Oh my god, I need to do something. Is there anything says on that board? Nope. Guess she can't read it. It's too high up. Literally jumped in from above, did I? <laughs> it was like, oh? <laughs> it does that on the Saturn, actually. And on some modern consoles. I'm surprised that the Saturn does it. Oh, it's just the pale heads, I guess. Try not to blow up the barrel and we'll be fine. How do the pale heads like the flame rounds? Jill, he's like there. The target choosing is so random. No, not the crawling guy. There's a standing guy right there. He's dead. Let's try with the uh, ice. I guess the acid wouldn't bother them. They're already melted. Hello. Can you even go there? It's filled with a nasty smelling liquid. No, she's not gonna... Ah, there we go. I was talking about shells. Now you give me shells. Thanks a lot. <laughs> I needed them like three areas ago. But I'll still grab it. The water pollution control device has stopped functioning. It displays an error message. Yeah, it's saying shit. When activating a polluted water disposal device, make sure that the area has been evacuated of all personnel. You cannot get any closer than this. I mean, you can. It's just going to be very painful if you do it. Yeah, I didn't know that was in the game. So, like, this is my second time playing this on hard mode. I didn't know all my life that the hard mode is actually the normal mode. I thought easy mode is the normal mode. So my friend told me about this a couple of years ago. I played it two or three years ago on hard mode. I was like, okay, this is cool. Demis has dropped some things, but I didn't get him all the times. I was afraid. <laughs> and then... Oh, wow. Like right there. Ah, I hope to get him from afar. It's really cool when the grenade hits them from god knows where. No, again, wrong zombie. So I downed him in every encounter this time. I got the pistol and the shotgun. I knew about those because I read about them first time I got them, but I didn't know about the infinite ammo. So I'm glad I loaded up that um, old save well, the one from 2-3 years ago where I completed it once on hard. Because it seems that otherwise, if this was my first hard playthrough, I would have gotten the assault rifle. Didn't know any of that. Zombie showed me some new cutscenes as well. And even with all the... I know that the game changes a lot depending on where you go, what you do. I still saw so much new stuff. It's like a whole... It's like for me the game got an update all of a sudden, you know. The system disk. Some kind of observation system is running. It seems to have been installed recently. Too bad they didn't get to use it. No, not combined. Seems to be a system disk used to release the treatment room lock. Okay. She knows all that just by looking at the disk. Probably has it on the label. I'm gonna guess. Oh, there's the map. Dead factory map. <laughs> 
So just one room left there and we're gonna go there via the elevator if I remember this correctly. Wait, if I didn't jump down, I'm trying to remember, if I went in from above, whoa, jeez. Oh, Nikolai? Yeah, run towards the guy with the gun. Nikolai? No, it's Santa Claus. So yeah, so this is the, okay, this is the, I'll be able to kill him in this, because I jumped down, that's it. I know it's one of those two choices. There's a card key reader electronically locked you have a grain launcher Jill but sure let's say it is <laughs> locked you can't access it yeah this is where I would but it didn't count like I was there that's weird and you can't see the lower area anymore this is the only uh, classic area map, map that does that can't go further. Nothing, nothing, nothing. It's just an inconspicuous factory located like right next to the park where a lot of people go. Great place to hide a secret lab, guys. <laughs> like in the, the Spencer Mansion lab and... Oh, fuck that. Why am I doing that? Should have just blown him up right away. Let's do that. Um, the Spencer Lab and the Spencer Mansion Lab in the Arclay and the one under... It's also disguised as a death factory or something. The You know, the ones from RE2 and Zero. I guess explosions are his weakness. Wait, you're not gonna aim at him? Oh, I was hoping to trick him. Guy? This guy is playing with me, is he? Got him. Get in. Okay, here I could save. Oh yeah, somebody, please tell me if I'm missing. I know um, the same friend who told me the hard mode is the real mode. I know you can do something if you collect all the files. They should turn into Jill's diary or something. This is manager's diary, not Jill's diary. April 25th. Today is my 30th birthday. I was transferred to this facility today. Oh my god, he's young. He's younger than me. Horrible. <laughs> I am very happy because the work environment is very different from life in the university. May 14th. So he came here where? April 25th. 5th. May 14th. The disposal system has been completed. Using a special kind of gas, it can de decompose the cells of the guinea pigs. We have to try this out before beginning practical usage of the system, since, since it is not 100% stable yet. What do you mean, zombie? May 20th. While I was checking the treatment room, the door shut and I was locked inside. I couldn't get out for one hour. I guess even if you have the key card, it's useless when you are locked inside. June 7th. The guinea pigs have we have to dispose of are increasing. The system is not working smoothly. The laboratory staff doesn't listen to my opinions and I am getting extremely frustrated. July 16th. So this is after the mansion incident. We can't dispose of all the bodies and the quality of the liquid medicine is not good enough either. July 29th. Though the function of the system decreases, the number of the bodies we have to dispose does not. The infection level has increased and the antibodies we are using antibodies we are using is no match for the new mutation of the virus. We should have count next time we count all these spelling errors. Some of the workers and grammatical errors. Some of the workers have been infected by the disease. I have continued to work, but I always keep a gun with me. I must remember to save one bullet for me. I want to wee. I don't want to die here. I swear that I'll lose my mind if I imagine how painful the death will be. 
Yeah. So they started turning here. And they were like, yeah, it's fine. Come to work. Work at the Umbrella Lab. Yeah. That's the point of these files, really, to get you into the game. I mean, my, one of my favorite, all-time favorites will always be the Keeper's Diary from RE1. What's ROP? ROP? I'm actually going to use it now. And stack some of these. Save the best ones for the final encounter. Not even this. These two I can combine. No, actually, I might find more greens. Look at all the blue herbs. Why do I carry all these blue herbs? I obviously don't need them. But sure, why not? Hmm. I'll keep the disc. I'll keep this because I'm going to save. Well, that's about it. Oh. <laughs> yeah, anything's better than that. Like... <laughs> Diaries and books have been piled up in a disorderly fashion. What was this? The facility key. Yeah, that's the one I want to irradiate down there. So we got to go back down. A plastic card engraved with an ID attached to it. it. Seems to be coated with some kind of special painting. Yeah, it is, Jill. It's a very useful painting. Is that that's spray, is it? A weekly schedule is scribbled here. Scribbled? So let's go do the let's go do the tag thing first. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'll come back with to save. I brought the ink ribbon just in case I'm bringing it with me. Might serve me good. Hmm, are the hunters gonna, hunters or uh, drained emas gonna spawn when I do the key thing, I think. Not this, why do I have to push the button, just take me down, it's just two floors, it's pointless. Nothing yet. Oh, I better take care of that. I don't like where it is. Is it gonna kill me? No, it shouldn't. Just accident waiting to happen. Why do they have a fucking explosive barrel in the factory? Charge! Oh yeah, the door's here. So I get it. I get it why you said it's easier if you go down here, zombie. Because you immediately go do this. The water thing. Though you have to come back for the rocket launcher thingy. For emergency explosions. <laughs> Wilson, we need you to detonate that barrel. Stat. Why, boss? Because it's our emergency explosion barrel, man. Did you read the manual when you got hired? <laughs> Where do you take the facility key? You've taken the facility key. <laughs> Wilson, after you detonate the barrel, pick up your stuff. You're fired, man. The plastic card is radiating. It seems to show some kind of coat pattern. As if it's radiating, don't bring it with you. <laughs> uh... Not much left to do. Dance with Nemi one more time. Nikolai Mercenaries. You know what? I am willing to try that. It's the only, literally the only RE classic, well, any RE bonus game that I enjoy playing. 
truth be told, I never tried the mercenaries anything later, but it just doesn't sound like... Yeah, I did actually, in RE4. It's not fun for me. And then RE5, I'm pretty sure I tried it in RE5. Didn't hold me. Yeah, that's what I was holding. That's why I destroyed the barrel. Oh, shit! Freeze, asshole! Oh, freeze the entire body, not just the asshole. Oh, this could be sweet. Uh, freeze your feet, people. All right. Your blood? Nikolai starts with the sig and the knife, right? That's like if you really want to punish yourself. I was trying. I think earlier this summer when I was practicing for Nemi. In front of the RPD. I did try a few times. Very brutal. A very brutal game. Oh. Can I even take it now? I think I can. He's playable in Mercenaries, right? Is there a single weapon in RE3 that takes up two slots? I'm just thinking about it. Maybe the Gatling gun? The rocket launcher doesn't take two slots, I'm pretty sure. Ah, this part. Okay, let's go down first. Because it's locked with a card key, no less. Ah, yeah. So nothing I can do there yet. But I can do this. Is, are, are those blues? If they're only blues? Fuck them. Yeah, no thank you. What can poison me here, though? That one looks a little green, but I doubt it is. This one now, right? Oh, okay. Okay, switch that. Yeah, gotta open over there. So I can do this, that's right. Come on. So useless. <laughs> What's the point of this? It's only if you're in Raccoon. I heard there's not gonna be a Krauser in the remake. Is that true, zombie? There you go. The controls... This controls the power for the safety system. It's set to standby mode. Will you push the switch? Yes. What does that mean? Power has been supplied to the safety system. Which is conveniently right there. Wait, is it showing where... It, yeah, it's showing where I think it's showing. Because it's right next to the elevator, yeah. Really? So it's true, huh? It's a weird decision. He was a major character and kind of defined Leon's past, right? Like, even if even me not being a fan of RE4, he was a good inclusion, you know what I mean? Lock seems to have been released. Okay, it's time. <gasps> Almost burned my privates. Come on. Your perspective is lying. Don't trust it. Anything in the garbage? No? I was expecting to say, don't know, don't care. <laughs> I think a Scorpion posted a video about it. The Resident Evil guy on YouTube. I saw. I just saw the title, I didn't get to see the video yet. I barely get to see anything these days, but... There was a... It said something about no Krauser in RE4. Like, seriously? Because that's a weird decision. To can Krauser. 
Well, yeah, really. I agree. I know we disagree. I like 7 a lot. You don't like it. A lot of old school RE players don't like it, which surprises me. It's the closest thing to RE1 we got in like a long time. Since RE1, definitely. Maybe RE2, that was <laughs> close enough to RE1. But you know what I mean. And I thought, I hoped 7 would be like that, would give me that. But I also doubted it a little because it was obvious they were taking inspiration from 4. People still like that one. Man, if Outbreak, if they announced Outbreak coming back, I would, I would, what's, what's called, pre-purchase? Pre-order it? Right? No, th without a thought, just like, how much? 100 bucks, sure. I can go without food for a few months. What is that? I've done worse. I was raised in Serbia, for crying out loud. For Outbreak, yeah. Like, no. <laughs> Wouldn't even think about it. <laughs> <laughs> Sasha knows it's true. She knows how much I love Outbreak. How much I suffer internally for not being able to play <sighs> lately because of the internet. God. Oh, don't, don't. <laughs> Mayo. <laughs> no. <laughs> I doubt. I really doubt. It. it was listed in that NVIDIA leak. That was true about a lot of stuff, but I don't know. I would so love it. I keep saying, you know, you don't even have to remake it. <laughs> Just port it. Is there no one here? Just port it to modern systems. Like, it could... Just... No... Um, no fuss it would work on Xbox One and further. Maybe even on Xbox 360. But, you know, I don't expect that. Just port it to Xbox One and PlayStation 3. No, 4 and onwards. And... Make a deal with the observe people. Just you, they can do this much cheaper than you know normally would. Just make a deal with them. <laughs> they can maintain the servers. Do the best you can. People will play it. What do you mean Sega? Because of the Sega network. Only in Japan. No, wait. No, only in Europe. The Japan Japanese version uses the other one, AV Access or something like that. So Sega owns the Western servers. Well, the the technology for those servers, the um, the 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 other, like the Japanese. So oh, sorry, I'm tired. <laughs> European and American versions use the Sega Network Access thingy, STCP. I forgot what it's called. The Japanese one uses AV e Access TCP something. And, uh, but even regardless, you know, I'm sure they could go around it. Funny thing, they could release Chapter of the City for money. <laughs> yeah. The kids don't have what to eat. They can eat the grass, the trees, the neighborhood, neighbor's dog. I don't care. I need this. Yeah, it's true, man. No, 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 no. Online play, definitely not. Without online play, that's not it. Online play, work with the observed people for the servers, like the emulated ones. It can be done. Like, even all the legal stuff can be avoided, and it could be, it would be much cheaper than producing a new game or a remake. Because that's what they want. They want to get money with minimum investments. As we've seen with Resistance, I'm pretty sure our reverse is not going to have, um, of, like, what is it going to have official, like, you know, dedicated servers. I doubt they're going to spring for that, so. Well, yeah, but that's what I'm saying. It's not even Sega. Sega is only for the Western versions. They will, they would port the Japanese one. I doubt, I mean, the best one to port would be, or to emulate would be the PAL version. Because that one's the, like, most complete, especially for File 2. The File 1 doesn't even have online. But I'm sure they would go with the Japanese one. It had most of the features, and it has nothing to do with Sega, really. The inside of the wall is exposed here. Someone seems to have been working on the wiring. Like working with a hammer. It sounds like Willy was here. Oh, it's coming. I want to check everything I can before it happens. What is going to happen? Oh, does it even happen here with this? Seems to be a part of the electrical equipment. There's nothing suspicious about it. A large size refrigerator. There are claw marks that indicate that something tried to crack it open from inside. So I guess it's still inside?
No, I think when the time comes, when they smell money, they will do it. It's the door is solid locked. It's a business decision after all. System disk, which is not a mail disk. Even though it is. Did I save? I hope I saved. I think I wanted to save, I know that. <laughs> Warning. Proceeding with operation in the treatment room. Please evacuate immediately. I don't think they'll learn something from that. Like they had something on their heads with hands with resistance, but they couldn't make it to function. It's just sad really at this point. Can you kill him without acid? I wonder. Look how cocky I am. I just rushed in here with two double greens. Okay. I wonder, can you like kill him without using the valves? Ooh, 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 ooh. Is he getting him? Nope. He does go down for a second. Oh, they're really strong now, the freeze rounds. Wait, do I dodge him here? I forgot what to do. Nope, he's not gonna... There you go. Wow, really leveled up those freeze rounds. I never did this like this, like even on easy mode I would just use the things. It's very fun. I'm so excited about this run. I keep saying it, but it's just because I really want to signify how excited I am for this. I'm dead tired right now, but this is keeping me up. It is used for the card reader at the disposal facility. Not even a rink ribbon? You would expect an ink ribbon in garbage dump in Raccoon City. Because everybody seems to dump theirs. Faucet is too tight to turn. Shouldn't she? Yeah, that's what I expected. Didn't seem to work the first time. What about here? Just dripping, okay? No. Did I check that? Yeah, I did. So tired. Now nah, we're not in a hurry. <laughs> oh, you tried that. I, I bet you tried that, Mayo. Okay, okay. Another very good cutscene. Is it me or the RE3 cutscenes? At least some of them run on like lower frame rate than RE2. Because RE2 on the PlayStation is so smooth. This this is more like the frame rate of the N64 version of RE2. Look how smooth the door transition is. Even like you guys can see it in half the frame rate. Wait, is this where? I, no, this is where. No, this isn't where I want to go. Yeah, well, GameCube is just port of this. They they already made it like that. I don't think they can. I think that's how the cutscenes were made with that frame rate. Oh, how is that not... Okay, that, that hit him somehow. I keep pushing this guy towards me. Yeah, I read about that. Wait, wasn't that for the... I know RE2 revisioned. 
Japan Revision 1. I don't know. I don't remember the RE3 revision. I remember RE2 because uh, when I was trying to play my old PC version on Windows XP, it wouldn't work. It was only for like Windows 98 and such system like old systems. I think 98. Barely you could play it on 2000 Millennium. Oh really? Yeah, I only knew about uh, about the two. Oh shit, yeah. That's why we went there. I gotta check that out. I'm really curious. I saw some recordings back in back in I think 2006, seven, of the boosted RE2 version that worked on Windows XP. It looked very nice. I wonder, so if they made the cutscenes already like that, they probably used interpolation to get them to higher frame rate. It makes sense, because the GameCube version was literally just a port of this. Nothing added, nothing changed. That's the rocket launcher. It's closed with a sturdy looking door. There's a tiny slot where a plastic card could fit. Meep. Hello, baby. Could you could you mix the infinite ammo add-on with the rocket launcher? I know you get it late, but that would be fun. Rocketing everything from this point. Suppressing fire! Oh shit, we gotta do that in one of the future runs. Just run the end of the... Can you kill Nemesis without the railgun? Just shoot rockets at him until your hand starts... <laughs> hurting, then swap hands and shoulder and keep shooting. Okay, so at this point I don't need literally nothing else. I'm just gonna drop all this and focus on health. Not even that health, just the best health for Jill at this point. Not even that. Fuck that. Especially that. Oh, quiet rocket launcher. Oh, fuck, I didn't want to do that. That, that's how I want to do it. There you go, two weapons enough. Unless you kill him. Okay, okay. So what if you... I saw a doc doing something weird the other day. What if you weaken him with this? With the rocket launcher and then finish him with a railgun would that then count like instead of two railgun hits or three was it you just have one or two less you know what i'm asking this is it let's say fuck it i don't want to repeat this if i fuck something up i'm barely functioning at this point i'm gonna be left with 25 unused incredibles i thought it's not enough of them in the game on hard mode i was wrong Well, too bad, you gotta do the 13 save. Fuck it, just do it. I guess that's 0-1, if I remember correctly, that means that I'm doing the first repeat. As an add-on, like an outbreak, or... Because I don't remember... Probably as an add-on. I played the, the PC version a lot in the 2004-2006 period. Did I forget the card? No, I didn't. Why am I so lost? Ah, okay, okay. That's what that's what I meant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Oh, I was hoping to hit him from afar. Pale heads in the in the classic REs were pretty cool. I 
I didn't bring those doubles, I forgot, but there we go, we got the doubles here. Maybe we can get, we can get a red one, who knows. <laughs> here we go, uh, guess it's time for the rocket launcher. Man, I miss Metal Slug. Every time I say a rocket launcher, I want to say the rocket launcher. Heavy machine gun. No, not really at this point game, though. Thank you. It's very kind of you to offer. Do we have everything? Two files left. Do I have everything up to this point? He is, really. Is there a file here? I think there's going to be a file here. The tracker? It is the tracker file that you get. Does that count? So can, can you kill Nikolai with anything other than the rocket launcher? Can you use, like, the grenade launcher shoot at the chopper? It's a portable radar receiver. You got the radar receiver. Alright. I guess I did get the radar receiver. Nope, just the rocket launcher. Okay. Thanks for the quick replies, Mayo. You know, I have no idea how much I appreciate this. Such persistence. Nikolai? You mean the resistance? Sorry, but there is no escape from here. Just so long. What is it like? It gives me a choice if I remember correctly. How much does he need to kill me though? I never got killed by him. Negotiate or return fire to you know what? We're past negotiation, my man. That must have hurt. Not even a vibration. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I doubted you game for a second. Jill, what happened? Late to the party as always, Carlos. Carlos. The chopper is It sounds like it destroyed itself, even though I fired a rocket at it. I guess this is it then. But I don't want to die in a place like this. This isn't over yet. I'm not giving up, Jill. We still have a chance. Like Leon in RE2. The RE men... I am not going to give up. RE men are easily persuaded. Like, oh, it's finally over. No, we still have to find my brother. You're right. This is just the beginning. He's like, oh, we're dead. Ah, but we're still gonna keep trying. I don't mind. I want to live. I want Carlos to live. Carlos is good people. Carlos, do you have rocket resistance? I guess not. Let's not find out. Jill, that's it. We've got to find a way out of here now. It's d right there. <laughs> Off it goes. Warning. Missile attack. Warning. Missile attack confirmed. Emergency level D. All personnel evacuate. E or A. So my first playthrough, for very first, I was like a 10 year old. All enemies will be destroyed. See that counter? I thought from this point I didn't know what to do. I don't remember why I got stuck. I didn't push the batteries or something, but I kept waiting for this number to go down because I thought, you know, you gotta be patient and wait. Well, we can only push forward. Oh, wait, don't use that. I don't know if you remember that, Lyubka, in, in the speed arcade. Wait, I'm, I need two files. I, it's like I'm missing a file. Uh, combine those, you know what, bring everything. Just go wild. Bring all the weed. Don't need ammo, just weed. They're gonna get up, are they? I think they are. Not yet, I guess. Kinda remember. Yeah, some of them are alive, sure. Is that it? No one else alive? Okay, so two of them are gonna be here, alright? 
Next to the ladder, really? Good to see you, David. On the wall next to the ladder. Ah, there, there we go, I think. Thank you, thank you. I totally didn't see that, man. How are you doing, bro? Incinerator manual. This incinerator plant is one of the facilities that burns the disposable items which are sent from the laboratory. The incinerator burns the waste materials that cannot be decomposed at the treatment room. It also supplies electricity to the facility by a thermal power electricity generator. Part of the electricity is stored in the big battery installed in the facility's underground area. The electricity is used as an auxiliary power source. The auxiliary power circuit will be activated once the three auxiliary circuit units are properly placed in their sockets. In case the circuits are not connected automatically, a person can connect them manually to activate the system, which is like push, push hard. Yeah, I'll try that. That's a, what I think that's what I saw Doc do the other day. David, man, I didn't know this game has fucking infinite ammo add-on from Nemesis. Like his final drop, his final contribution to Jill is infinite ammo. That's so kind of him and so cool to have the my favorite weapon with infinite grenades. Oh, thanks. No thanks now. Yeah, I remember. Yeah, I know the last one. I think it's this one I always miss. See, I think there's even ink ribbon. No. So, how do I get the special file Mikhailo has been telling me about, huh? Yeah, Zombie says it can be done, Mayo. Classified photo file. In my opinion, I feel that it's too early to use this Paracelsus sword. Paracelsus's in actual fighting. However, in order to acquire the G virus that Umbrella has developed, it will be a great help to. Like what? Fry fucking Birkin? <laughs> the power of the rail cannon, rail cannon, is satisfactory, but please note that it is still having a few remaining problems. Technology Division, Colonel Franklin Hart. Okay, what now? How do I get the secret file? This is the next game. This is the next game. Yeah, or, or you mean the infinite ammo. So what now? Mika told me to read something to get it. Read what? Oh, really? I didn't know that. Oh, he, he... Just wait, Lyubka. Just get ready. Nemesis dies in the middle of game. Oh, I thought I was gonna get it. A special forces member's body. Where is this compared to the rest of the factory? So if I came, I came in from where? From the west. So it's, this is literally behind the factory. Okay. Glad to know. We're in the opposite side of the park. All right, all right, man. No, that's the final contribution. But that doesn't mean he's dead. This is one of Umbrella's deadly bioweapons. So this is like a T-003 series? The cousin of T-00? Is that like a capsule where they find... Yep, a transportation pod. It is marked as T. I remember this. I didn't know what this was because I played three first and then then two second. But now it makes complete sense. That one went into super tyrant. And they go into super tyrant mode when they when their limiter is destroyed. They have a power limiter so they wouldn't go crazy. They can could be controlled. So if the Oh is there that's a rocket launcher. I never noticed that. There's a rocket launcher. A corpse of a US Special Forces member. I guess he used up his rocket launcher. Fighting the tyrant or something? Not gonna comment on the giant ass fucking <laughs> railgun there? Check in system. Yeah, there you go, zombie. Check 
Warning. There is not enough power to activate the system. Huh. Do I have to go in order? Yeah, you have to push them in order. It's very specific batteries. After I push the first one, he should surprise me. Wait, is that a guy? Hey, look at him, he's hanging. What the fuck happened here? I always was wondering, like, what the hell happened here? I want to know more about this battle. I guess it's in one of those side games. Yeah, it sounds like a Serbian wedding. <laughs> here we go. There's Nami, Ljubka. Still fighting. He's gonna claw me to death. <laughs> this is his ultimate form. He can't even stay, stay stars anymore. He's got a Metroid head. Don't sneeze at me, boy. That's very rude. Come on, push, push for the love of fuck, Joe. Come on, push. Why is that so hard to push the batteries of all the things? Gotta make sure it doesn't fry me, instead of him. Oh shit, you can do that. Oh! Hurts! Quit it! Come on, jump in front. He's not gonna jump in front. Oh, jeez. Well, that's not very nice. Can I dodge that? Let's try to dodge. No, can't dodge that. Did I miss something? Still gotta hit him more than once. Don't die. Let's hope he's in the line. Yeah, he does. Oh shit. He's not even there. Where are you, Nami? There he is, so slow. Okay, I'm gonna go into the corner again. Damn, I'm gonna get blasted. Shit. I've never had this happen like this before. I will, I will. Where the f oh shit, there he is. I was wondering where he is. He showed me where he is. Okay, now I want to run behind. Don't get stuck there. 
Oh god, I'm stuck. Is that the acid? Yeah, the acid keeps hurting me. Fuck, he's dead. That's it. Goodbye, Nelly. That's okay. I shot him with the biggest weapon. That's okay. It's okay. It's okay. This isn't a hard battle. It just requires patience. It's just more than more of a reward than anything. Imagine dying while the cutscene is doing. Thanks, guys. I wanted to see how many. It's still three oil rail shots. I was hoping to do it with less. Nothing there. He's just melting. He's melting. Okay, we don't need the weapon anymore. The game's done. That's it. Oh Jesus! I thought it froze completely. Nothing there until she needs it, though. Here we go. The one-liner of the series. Exterminate or ignore and evacuate. You know what? We're doing an aggressive play, so fucking exterminate him. So you can't dodge it. I know you can dodge it. Exterminate. She said while not moving her lips. <laughs> That's my favorite one-liner from this game. Yeah. <laughs> you know who you came to watch, zombie. You want stars? I'll give you stars. Now he's really melting like Yon was in the olden days. After all of that, finishing off with a magnum. <laughs> Warning. Oh. Elevator control panel will you operate. This is the only thing you can do. No other options. Just operate and hope for the best. It's a unique elevator in the classic REs. Well, let's get saved by an old friend. Jill! It's over, Carlos. What are you talking about? Don't you hear that? There's a second chopper, and it's here to rescue you. There's a third chopper already. Who could possibly be looking for me? Who could it be? It doesn't matter. We just have to be there when it lands. How does he know that? That was always like, what did he hear? <laughs> that, that, that was the goal of this episode, yeah. <laughs> Enjoy the ending, guys. This is it. Thanks. <laughs> you saved us. I couldn't let you die. Is, is it you? Are you ready to finish this? Why does he sound like that? Why does Barry sound like... It's coming! Someone else. <laughs> All the locations you visited. He knew exactly where to come for her. But yeah, this makes me sad every time. The news report, the music, everything. Somewhere there, the outbreak survivors are escaping their own chopper. Oh, it gets sadder. This part. And now we have a rather unfortunate turn of events. It seems that the President and the Federal Council have passed judgment over the civilians of Raccoon City. The President and Federal Council have ruled that the back to terminate operation is the best course of action for this extreme situation and have since executed. Based on that fact, Raccoon City has been literally wiped off the map. Current reports have the death toll surpassing the 100,000 mark. Our 
hearts go out to those poor civilians of Raccoon City. Solid stake. <laughs> Me too, man. Me too. <laughs> this... Like I said, I was 10 when I first played this. It was really sad. I thought we were gonna beat the big bad corporation, but they win, kinda, in the end. You don't get the... Conclusion to that until RE4, even there, then it's not really the kind we wanted to, right? So what's gonna do next? Next, I, I'm looking for a copy of RE Survivor. I haven't played that in maybe even 20 years, 15, 20 years. So I'm looking for that, the PAL copy of it. If I can't find that, we're gonna do Code Veronica next on the Dreamcast, I think. David, do we have? Uh, Paul Code Veronica here. That would be really nice. Well, yes and no. It's, they didn't want to infect the entire city. They wanted to keep the thing. It was an accident that the virus broke out. So, yeah. Yeah, I think we do. I'm not sure. It's, I gotta check. It's in the closet. I just... A really good ending theme, too. So yeah, next week we're gonna, what do you say, I think we're gonna do another run of Eternal Darkness, Chaturga run, while I look for a survivor copy, if not, we'll just straight to Code Veronica. I, I, I never had Survivor, I only, I played it from an arcade, and uh, I know the so the US version doesn't, but the PAL version supports the light gun. I'm not sure if it has to be a specific one, but you can play with a light gun, just like in Japan. Only the US version didn't have that. And <laughs> yeah, Hung fucked it up. Um, that would be nice. I know David has a light gun, a PlayStation light gun down there in my storage. Right, David? So if I found a survivor, it would be nice to play. Can you even play it with a light gun on this TV? I'm not sure. Probably need to get one of those CRT TVs. What do you mean out? Out of commission? Yeah, I think because it needs the... Oh yeah, I'm not streaming during the weekend. I need some rest. Well, no, actually, tomorrow morning I'm doing D. <laughs> tomorrow morning I'm doing... Um... Friday the 13th with Joseph and Raph, possibly. But that's it. I don't think I'll do anything else. Nothing else is on the schedule, not planned, so yeah. Do we get a new epilogue? You got two costumes. I think I already had two costumes. Yeah, it needs a CRT. I do have a CRT. Somewhere. Yeah, that's gonna be early tomorrow morning, sis. 7, 8 a.m., something like that. Outbreak. You mean stream? No point if I can't play it, man. Like, that's that's what I want tomorrow. Oh, here we go. Please forgive me, Claire. Chris Redfield has just finished this letter with his signature phrase. Please forgive me, Claire, is his signature phrase? As he removes his sunglasses, a lady walks by him with light steps. She looks about the same age as Claire, he thinks. A short time later, Chris discovered that his sister was looking for him, but was caught. Oh, the, okay, this is this ties in into Code Veronica. Nice. And Chris, while well, he still looked look like a human being, that's very, very cool. Where can I check the epilogues? I think in one of the menus. Gotta back up this on the hard drive immediately. Never, 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 never. Okay, so if I go to load, because we got one epilogue previous time, right? Resident Evil. There we go, epilogue. So they just go in order, it doesn't matter what you do. I thought it has something to do with, you know, the order of things you do. 
After escaping the city, Jill set out to join Chris Redfield. However, all she found was an empty hideout of Chris's. You don't put an S after the apostrophe for possessive with an S. <laughs> On the floor was Chris's knife, again. Jill left without hesitation because she firmly believes that Chris is still alive. She will search for him until she finds him. Then they can go and put an end to Umbrella. Well, that's just like you found his bloody knife and you don't think it's... <laughs> You think he's still alive? Very, very positive of you. <laughs> positive thinking there. All right, folks, that's it for tonight. I'm like I feel like a hero for doing this, considering how tired I was. Let's see. Let's see who we can raid. Thanks everyone for watching, for all the support. Zombie and Mayo for being my walking walkthroughs, walking living walkthroughs. Thank you, sis. Lubka for always being here. David for I know he's dying after work, working for probably for twelve hours, still getting over here. Thank you, everyone. Senpai somewhere there in the background dying. Trollsaurus, well, you just woke up, but you had you got your breakfast fun. <laughs> oh. Come on. Bye. Oh, there we go. Or it's just the lighting, probably. I'm dying here. <laughs> Who are we gonna raid? Raid. There you go. Michelle's doing RE7. Great segue. We're coming for someone who likes RE7. What is Silent Hill 2? What about Silent Hill 2? Oh, you mean Doc? Yeah, that would have been good probably, but I'm trying to mix it up, not to raid the same person every time. Uh, if the games match at least. So that's it. Thanks everyone again. Tomorrow morning, Friday the 13th, Monday. New schedule coming out this weekend. Keep an eye for it. Enjoy your weekends. Till next time. Bye-bye.